I just wanted to make a quick update, set your scale to 0.5 and scale in everything. And make sure you're using scale 0.5. And make sure you do it on both sides. Take these frames, scale them in. Same with these piece. And also that part in the back, just like that. Take this and scale it as well. Set your move to 0.5. Move everything on this back once, 0.5. Actually, we could probably do it twice. Do the same thing for this as well. Just, just the silver piece. Because every, because what you're gonna do with the centerpiece is only scale. So scale that back till everything connects again. And then scale this, scale that. Also to set a better connection here, just so that it doesn't break in any time in the future, take a titanium block and just build right. Oh yeah, by the way, this inside where the wheels are, place it right on those um, pistons, the pistons that I'm putting them on. Now quickly save, I'm gonna quickly test. Okay, so after the test, I've just realized um, this has to scale up as well. This has to scale up as well. And this has to scale up as well. So just make sure everything connects. Everything that you saw me scale right now is what you have to scale. Now set your scale to 0 0.5 and just move these back a bit. One, two, three. There you go, it should be good. Okay, these th these legs look a little too thin, so what I'm gonna do is set um, my scale to 0 0.5. Just scale those out like that. And that looks pretty nice. Um, scale out 0 0.5 on every single part. Make sure that everything is connecting just like that. 0 0.5. Yours probably won't be um, built evenly just like mine. So you're gonna have to scale out on every single part, not like just on one side or anything. And now you wanna take this piece, scale that back just a little bit, just this side panel so that the leg is not touching any of it. Same on the other side. I'm actually going to also do this, set your scale to two real quick. Uh, open these legs up just like, wait, hold on, wait, 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 wait. Do the same to the other side as well. Just scale by two. Every part. Just do this. Open up every single block just by one. And then this final piece you're going to move on its own. Now what you're going to want to do is open just these panels up. This and then you'll see this. Open that up as well. And delete the two pistons. I know, I know. But just as long as you follow what I'm doing, then you should be totally fine. Now take everything in here. Set your move to two. Take everything in here. And just move it once. And you should be fine if you still see that little space, those little gaps. Now off of this block, you're gonna want to place two pistons. <clears throat> now edit the settings on both of them. And then set the piston length into six. So what this should do, just push both of them out. Oh yeah, make sure both of them are unanchored while you're building right now. So just push both of them out and then wherever you see it lands now, uh, just adjust. So place a block, um, actually hold on. There's no point of the frame, I've just realized. Okay, so now what you want to do is move this one using 0 0.5. Okay, just like that. Then you want to take one titanium block, put your camera inside, uh, set your move to two, place it right in there, and do the same for the other side. So like usual, move it twice with scale 0 0.5, and then place a block right in there. Now you can... You don't actually have to close up anything here. I've just realized. Just close up this using scale 2. Just close up that. You don't have to close up uh, any of the 
frame or whatever. We might have to make his waist a little smaller though. So I'll quickly save this. So set your scale to two. You can shorten some of this. Just everything that's poking out. This should be very easy. Just do it until there is all that space, just like that. And now take your move tool. Oh yeah, that's looking better, that's looking better. Take your move tool, select everything right here, move it, move it once. And then you can quickly save. I'd suggest you reload by now. Now delete this lever on the left and then just place it again, you know, just so everything links back once again. And now what you want to do is take a titanium block and let's start building the chest of Optimus Prime. So set your move to 0.5 so that you can build right off of there. Then set it to 1, flatten that out. Clone this piece onto the other side, paint it red as well. Actually, no, don't clone it. Don't clone it. Now do this. With scale 2, do 1, 2, and then set your scale to 1, and then do it once. So just like that, then align again. Just build around this, you know, pretty, pretty basic stuff. Just like that. Clone this. Push it all the way up here. Oh, yeah, you might ha have to use movement uh 0 0.5 so that it aligns well as well then just fill in all of those gaps just like that with the back you could just fill it in like this but this part you're gonna have to work on the chest so take this part clone it to the other side and take this part clone it to the other side as well but this part you're you might have to do on its own take the window Align it right there. I suggest a black tint. Uh, set your transparency to 25 and paint it uh, not fully black, but this black. Now set your scale to one, flatten that out. Fill this up. Is that too wide? Yeah, I think that's too wide, just like that. This is three blocks long. Then set it to scale to one, two, three. Set your scale to 1, push it back. Now clone this, move it to the other side. See how that looks? What that looks fuck? pretty bad. But don't worry, just follow what I'm doing. Uh, scale this down once. And then scale it towards the middle once. Scale these down once, all of this titanium. Make sure you're following every, every step. Take your titanium, align it move it towards here and then just build that lining just like that now fill this part in as well just like so oh you might want to fill this in if you have gaps in this silver part as well fill that in okay so now what you want to do is actually set your move to one because i forgot a step uh actually just select all of these new red panels that are and the windows that are above the silver lining and move it just twice now move it up so that there's one block of space fill this part in because it's very simple but for this part you want to clone this block actually make sure the space is clear Make sure it looks like this. Clone this block, move it down there. Okay, so with this part, I think I'm gonna scale this back just once. Just like this, widen out the mirrors even more. Mirrors, I mean windows more. And make sure to just fill in all of that space as you're making these edits. I feel that could be too wide. Let's try 0 0.5, 0 0.5, just like that. Make sure there's 0 0.5 space just in between. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay, so now that you've got that done, what we're gonna start doing is the arms. Now, the guy who I helped, 
I did not make his as good as this one, to be honest. Because I'm adding more detail. I'm gonna give this one weapons. <clears throat> his didn't have weapons, though. Now find the center of this block. Just like that. Take a piston. And then set the piston length to 10. And then push it out. So now what we're going to do here is place a block. Set your scale to 0 0.2 and then scale that in where you see like you know the glitchy looking and then scale it in from there as well now what you want to do is add a block another titanium block here set your scale to 0.5 scale this in just like that and set your scale to 2 and then scale it out 1 2 3 uh, 4 okay 4 and then we're going to scale this down one two three so basically those are the smoke stacks so now we're gonna work on this upper arm take the smoke stack push it in using move 0.2 take this scale by two until it's like barely touching then scale it so that it fills in these spots but it does not go over it literally barely goes up or almost what it literally almost goes over which is perfect actually so now you just want to build the surrounding walls all right so just fill in a box you know it doesn't matter how you're doing it just make sure you're filling a box that does not go past uh the torso so just make sure you're building it like mine just like this so basically my arm is a 5x5 five five cube with the piston here being the center. So now what you want to do is oh wait. Now what you want to do is start scaling using uh, number scale 1 and scale it so that it's only aligned with the red. All right, now what you want to do for this part is set your um, move to 1. Just scale that like a little border just around here and if you want to see in detail i'll paint this red now you want to align these smokestacks with this part of the arm so now that that's aligned that should be good all right that's good now what we're going to do is make sure that this like lower part now make sure that this silver part aligns with the this part of the torso all right, that's nice, that's nice. Now you want to find the center of all this and just place a block there. Make sure make sure it, it looks like this. Take a piston, set its length to 10.5. Let's see how far that goes. What I'm gonna do is take this part, clone it, just these four blocks of the red one and align it once again. Now I'm gonna just delete the inner part just like that. And I'm going to scale this lower because it's looking pretty blocky right now. Okay, set your move to one. Make sure it all connects. Here's something that the other guy actually does not have fixed on his version. Because I was too lazy to fix it since it wasn't even my version anyways. So scale back every single part uh, 0 0.2 just like this let me just select all of this turn it turn it unanchored then change the piston length because the piston length is a little too ridiculous so there eight is already better that's already looking better because the arm was way too blocky on the other one and that's totally fine because it's not mine anymore set your scale to one and then just scale back all of this Uh, the piston can stay where it is. What I suggest you do is change your move to 0 0.5 and start filling these blocks. So what I mean by that is these empty spaces. Yeah, just fill them up right now. Just real quick. So such as the parts which I'm doing right now, just fill them in. 
Now set your scale to two. Keep moving this until. Keep moving this until you have finally hit the piston with scale two. Now what you want to do, or like once you've surpassed it. So I think that's a pretty good length. What you want to do now is take this piston, move both of this to the right once, just like that. And then now you can fill this in. So I, I'm going to scale this inward. I'm going to scale this inward. All of the, oh, wait. Uh, select everything, turn it anchored. Uh, okay, so if that just happened to you, um, what you want to do is place this right here. Uh, scale the scale it just like this paint it red again and using scale one just scale everything inward and then of course fill in all those spaces and boom you can fit something in here now so what i'm gonna do is um change this to uh nine set the, set the piston length to nine now take a block set it to, set your scale to 0 0.5 scale it down and make sure it connects with everything just like so i'd suggest filling this entire part in as well and now what we're gonna do is add a fist or a gun we're gonna add a gun now i'm gonna have to cheat my way through this because g1 optimus he has a gun you equip and also like energy blades or ion blade or whatever <laughs> basically his ion blaster i can't be i'm not able to do because it won't fit simply it just simply won't fit so all right so find the center real quick all right so place a piston if you can find the center in the center set the piston length to 10 all right, that seems pretty good. Now for this blaster, how I'm going to go about it is pretty simple way because to be honest, it's hard to make circles here. All right, so we're making the Bayverse version of the his gun, his hand cannon. Uh, quickly take this orange. Actually, which one looks better? All right, that one works very well. So you want to make sure that it's just like this set your scale to two and then place this block right here what you want to do now is make this make this square which is about this thin it's half a block thin and now what you want to do now set scale 0 0.5 scale everything in just once just like that and then you can now go off of this part of the block do that on all four parts scale it inward just like so and then scale it by two so that it fits in nicely just right there. Now clone this with uh, clone one and then just set your scale to 0 0.5, one, one, just fill in that. And then clone this piece that we just made down there. So that should look really nice. Uh, set the gun to black and duplicate set your clone to 0 0.5 and just duplicate these pieces so that it aligns with everything that we've just placed so just like this i can probably clone this as well and just like rotate it right there yeah you can do this as well just just like that there you go Alright, and there's the gun. See, it looks pretty good even for even though it is not a circle.